was the last time you bought groceries and were surprised by how cheap they were? Well, if it's ever happened, it's probably a distant memory. But this green grocer reckons there's a very simple way you can save. And I'm going to give you a reason to stop shopping at the supermarkets, guys, and I'm going to show you how much they're price gouging. 49 cents. Cavendish bananas per kilo there. Your supermarkets are two, three, four dollars there. Super sweet raspberries, whole tray, five dollars. Got to be three or four kilo in each bag yeah. at least. Yeah. And I've got to do checkout, three dollars ninety-five. Can you believe it? Three dollars ninety-five. Grocery bill shock of a different kind. The bananas, fifty cents a kilo for bananas, which is. Unbelievable. Like, I haven't seen that anywhere. When people see what we are selling things at, they ask the question, how can Woolies be selling it three times the price when you're at this price? Manager of independent fruit barn Skippy's Fresh Fruits, Elijah Etry is on a mission to expose supermarket secrets. Beetroot, supermarkets, about three, four dollars a kilo. Skippy's, 49 cents a kilo. Elijah takes to TikTok, telling Australians they're being ripped off. Hey guys, stop wasting your money into supermarkets where it's going offshore and into shareholders' pockets. His daily posts striking a chord with shoppers. And how do you feel when you see the prices at the supermarket and you know what you're charging for the same produce? I laugh. I see it and I laugh because I know what we can sell it at and I know what they're selling it at and I know what we're buying it at. Bulk buying fresh and in-season produce from Brisbane's Rockley Markets every morning is translating to cheaper grocery bills for Elijah's customers. You ever see something this cheap in Woolies or Coles? No, no. No? We need you, that's for real. Yeah. Different to the supermarket giants, we buy volume and we try sell volume. We don't try to put large markup on our products. We come in the other day, we bought a box. It had uh, capskins, potatoes, carrots, Everything. It had pretty much everything, yeah. Five bucks. Elijah's TikTok campaign is gaining momentum. He now has over 6,000 followers and he's calling on customers to support independence nationwide to increase market competition and inevitably, over time, force the giants to meet the little guys. If you start shopping local and supporting local businesses that are doing prices like this that benefit the consumer, then you're going to start to see more businesses open doing the same thing. Emily Toms is a school chaplain. She runs a breakfast program for families struggling to fill their kids' lunch boxes. It's not hitting some people, it's hitting everyone. We're all being affected. In a cost of living crisis, Elijah's trying to give back the power. We're just trying to bring awareness to everyday consumers that the prices that they're paying, it doesn't have to be like that. Independent stores are always able to get prices that are a lot more competitive. And as for our supermarket giants, he has this message. Have a think about the Australian public, how it affects their pockets. If we can afford to be cheaper, you can too.